Hi, welcome to Contributor Tutorials. My name is Sean, and today I'm going to show you how to straighten a crooked photo. When shooting for stock photography, it's not always possible to have your camera mounted onto a tripod. This is especially true when you're shooting portrait photography. You want to be able to move with your models and move where they go. And in these cases, you're probably going to be shooting handheld. However, when you are shooting handheld, there is the possibility that your photos won't be straight. I'm going to show you how we can use Photoshop to straighten out these photos. The first thing that we want to do is go to the Eyedropper Tools drop down menu and select Ruler. Once we have that tool, we want to click and drag along one of the lines that we want to straighten. And as we can see at the top, there is an angle that the ruler is set to, but we don't really need to worry about that. We're just going to go to Image, Image Rotation, and Arbitrary. As you can see, the ruler's actually calculated the angle that it needs to rotate the canvas, and it's even determined whether it needs to go clockwise or counterclockwise, and in this case, it is counterclockwise. I'm going to select OK. Now, we do have some white space that's been introduced into the image. This is Photoshop filling up the canvas for the areas that we rotated it from. So I'm just going to zoom out of this, and of course, we're going to have to crop this out. So the first thing that I'm going to do is just place a, a crop around the full frame of the image. And I do this just to keep the proportions of the original photo. So the next thing that I'm going to do is hold my shift key while I take one of the corners and I bring it in. I'm going to do the same thing with the top. And that looks pretty good. So I'm just going to hit return, which is going to make the final crop. As you can see the before and after. It's a small change. But it does make the photo look a little bit more polished and a little bit more professional, which is what our customers are after. I hope this has helped, and please check back for more tutorials. Take care.